am Satya, Assistant Professor, Department of Computer Applications, KSR College of Arts and Science, Fire Women, Tichugal. Now we are going to discuss about software development with Visual Programming Unit 1. Introduction to Visual Basic. Visual Basic is a defined as an object-oriented language and development environment developed by Microsoft in 1991. It has evolved from the earlier version of basic language, which stands for Beginners All Purpose Simple Standard Code. This article explains the fundamentals of Visual Basic is working features and uses. It allows programmers to define a behavior, function, and appearance of a different object by using graphical elements. In 1998, Microsoft released the latest version of VB Visual Basic 6. It is now re replaced with other versions like VB.net. Visual Basic for application and Visual Studio .net. Today, Visual Basic application and Visual Studio .net are two most commonly used Visual Basic platform across organizations. Next, working with Visual Basic. Visual Basic uses graphical user interface to design Windows application toolbox on left, design workspace in the middle, properties menu on the right. Here, step by step guide to create a simple VB application. Select file, new project, click the new application. Uh, click the VB application wizard icon with the new project dialog box appear. Click next to move from one dialog box to another. The wizard keeps a default value in the menu item, but it also allows you to edit the value in the menu item you intend to see in the end of application. The menu includes a dialog box, internet connectivity, which if selected give the creating application direct access to the web. It also allows you to send the application to other online users. For you reach the last step, the wizard provides a way to in interface with the database programs like Microsoft Access. Finally, click finish. The wizard will build the menu and add it to form. Upon closing the final dialog box, the wizard will display an application development environment where the form and code module can be viewed by double click on the project window. Run the program to test the view how it will be displayed on the screen. Next, the initial visual basic screen. Menu bar, toolbar, toolbox, form, project container window, project explorer window, properties window, description pan, form layout window. Next, the STA environment. The STA is the operation and control of IT infrastructure entirely using software technologies and without involvement of the human element. STA has emerged as a promising approach to address the extension demands on maximizing the value potential of the infrastructure deployments. The IT infrastructure therefore becomes intelligent taking smart decisions on their own. It's order to meet the defined goal on SLEA's performance, security, other consideration. Toolbar. The toolbar provides a user quick access to most commonly used functions of your program. A toolbar can be used stand alone or as a complete to the program's menu structure. Next, the toolbox and custom control and components. The tree view, list view, slider, status bar, program, progress bar, tab script and image control will appear in your toolbox as shown below. Next, starting a new project. In the Visual Studio data environment, select File New Project from the menu. Select Visual Basic on the left and then Console Application on the right. The Properties window. The Properties window lists the design time properties for selecting object and their current settings. You can change these properties at design time. When you select multiple controls, the Properties window contains a list of the properties common to all the selected controls to navigate the Properties window from the View menu of the Visual Basic Editor. Choose Properties window. Select the object whose or properties you want to display. You can either use the mouse to select the object or use the Project Explorer to choose from a list. Click the alphabetic tab to display properties in alphabetic order or choose the categorization tab to display object properties by category. Common form properties, back color. It is used to set the background color for the form. Background image. It is used to set the background image of the form. Cursor. It is used to set the cursor image when it hover over the form. Allow drop. It is used to allow drop control each form. It allow whether a whether to track or drop on the form font. It is used to get or set font in used in a form. Lock it. It determines whether the form is lock, locked or not. Scale properties with the height properties. These two properties determine actual determination of the control and are always expressed in the units of the container of the control. Let's and top properties. 